and coins through the ether data exchange first of all you need to um, open this link so if you open this link you will see that uh, there are a bunch of um, uh, sell orders you can click over here and purchase uh, fan coins um, for uh, some ether for example you can buy 100 fan coins for uh, 0.001 ethers so first of all you need to have a, a metamask plugin which is a chrome extension so uh, let's uh, download the um, metamask chrome extension so over here if you click over here um, we are going to download the metamask extension so you need to be on chrome and then when you add to chrome then it will install this uh, metamask extension so you just click on add extension and this will uh, start downloading and then installing the extension so metamask basically uh, serves as your uh, wallet where you can store cryptocurrency you can store ether you can store any ERC20 based um, compliant tokens on this wallet so as you can see um, the extension has already been installed so if we go over here um, this is the metamask plugin so this uh, little fox icon over here um, you need to accept the privacy policy and next you need to create an account so I'll just click and accept and here's a nice uh, thing about this fox when you move the mouse cursor it moves with you so I'm going to set a, um, a password for this one and then confirm the password and then create an account so next it's going to ask me um, like this is a random uh, I've copied this one so you need to copy this this is really important in order to restore your account you need to store this at a safe place so I've already copied that and next you, over here you can see that this is my account over here if I go over here and copy uh, this address this is my uh, wallet address and right now I don't have any ethers so next you need to <coughs> fill this up with some ether so ne next what I'm going to do is I already have a coinbase account so I'm going to transfer some uh, ethers to this address so let's do that so let me copy the address once again to make sure it's correct so I copy this address over here and then paste it over here so from my coinbase account I'm going to transfer some ethers to uh, this account so let's do a small amount 0 0.001 which is uh, worth less than our dollar let's do a bit more maybe 0 0.002 which is 1.6 um, US dollar and then um, I'll hit continue so this um, then I'm going to confirm the transaction and there's going to be some um, minor transaction fees minor transaction fees as well so I'm going to confirm that and make sure that this address is correct you copied it from here so once you confirm the ethers will be transferred to your account over here but it may take a while if it takes a while then you have to wait so over here if I come back back to metamask I can see I still don't have any ethers because it may take a couple of minutes to for the ethers to be transferred to my account so next what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to in the tokens tab I'm going to add a token over here this is very important because um, I'm, 
I'm going to uh, purchase uh, some Khan coins and uh, the smart contract address for Khan coins is this one. So I'll copy that address and then then what I'll do is I'll go to this add token tab and paste it over here. So once I paste the address over here, it automatically got the symbol KHN, which is the symbol for Khan coins, and then I add it over here. So let's see, it may take a while, but uh, ultimately it's going to show, show over here. So over here, it's showing me that I have uh, zero ethers. I, I'm going to get uh, some ethers in a while, but I have um, zero Khan coins. So once I buy um, uh, Khan coins through this Ether Delta exchange, then I'm going to get those Khan coins. But the important thing over here is on the top right, um, I need to um, sign in through this um, uh, MetaMask and then this top right will become green. So top uh, MetaMask will be serving as my word. So I'm going to um, press enter to refresh this page maybe it will um, detect metamask and show it on the top right so let's do that and uh, it's going to take a while to do it so over here you see it's already become green so it has um, detected my MetaMask account and um, over here it's going it's showing me that I have got zero Khan coins and I've got some ethers these are the ether that I just transferred so if you can see um, click on the MetaMask again uh, you can see that uh, the ether that I just transferred from Coinbase uh, they are showing up over here they are uh, worth 1.69 dollars of in my uh, MetaMask, I have got these um, um, 0.028 uh, ethers, but over here I have um, I need to deposit those ether to uh, ether delta in order to purchase these Khan coins. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to deposit 0.002 and hit the deposit button. So it's going to ask me for verification and I hit uh, submit button so basically what it will do is that it will um, uh, transfer my ethers from my metamask to ether delta so it's going to it may take a while so let's uh, wait for a while for the transaction to get through is we are going to purchase this um, uh, Khan coin so what you can see is that I have got 0 0.002 um, ether which is sufficient to buy these 100 coin, coin, Khan coins but I have also left 0 0.001 in MetaMask that will be used for the transaction gas fees this is uh, this, a small amount that I have kept so let's start the transaction I'm going to click on here I'm going to purchase 100 Khan coins, I can change this amount as well and it's going to cost me 0 0.001 ethers. So I'm going to hit the buy button and next is going to um, so let's try this one and um, start the transaction, hit the buy button. So it's going to um, it's going to cost zero point cost zero point eight seven uh, US dollar in transaction fee. So I'm going to submit that. Already got that in wallet. So uh, so I've just uh, created a buy order. Two hundred Khan coins over here in Ether Delta. It's showing me. So I'm going to go to the withdraw tab and withdraw these 200 Khan coins back to my MetaMask. So let's do 100 of them. So I'm going to, out of these 
200 i am going to withdraw uh, 100 to my uh, metamask wallet so i am going to hit that withdraw button and then going to submit so it has uh, been done already order initiated so after a while i'll see 100 of them transfer back to my wallet so let's try to refresh this page and see what happens and after that once it has been got to the my wallet it's going to show the con coins are going to show up over here right now it's showing zero but after a while it's going to show 100 Khan coins that I just purchased and withdraw to my MetaMask address. And 100 of them are transferred to my MetaMask. So you can see uh, the coins, the Khan coins that you just purchased over here. So it's over here, it's showing 100 Khan coins.